he now does. All set, and away they go. Untidy start, Lozado was a bit messy off the mark. Ignatius just needs a bit of riding to grab the bit. Love me again, Oathkeeper broke out. Well, the stable companions cut out the pace. Let me go, racing up with those and Burgess at their outside. Green with the white rings. Le Love me again, takes a seat in behind now. Central cities in the blue and silver colours. Texas Red is at the outside. The hoop sleeves and the blue cap racing with run for cover. All around the world is in the yellow jacket towards the far side. Then comes Lazaro. Black Lightning is nowhere and so too is Ignatius as they go through the halfway stage and pass the 600 metres mark. Burgess outside rail. Let me go. Oathkeeper being ridden along. Love Me Again is right there and Lozado getting into the race as well. Texas Red in between horses all around the world then a few lengths away to run for cover past the 300 meters mark and Love Me Again. Red and white colors pressed by Lozado. Burgess Texas Red all around the world up the far side but Lozado is in front 150 out. Burgess now giving it a go. Love Me Again. Texas Red they further back but Lozado with his head out in front and Lozado will beat Burgess. Third run for cover, and then came Texas Red. Ignatius, they're in the, the white sleeves and the blue cap. Look how much work that's got to do. Didn't get a sniff of winning the race, though. The winner's towards the right-hand side. The pink sleeves and the white cap. Lozado will uh, take out victory here from Burgess, who was nagging away the whole race. Run for cover in the light blue colors. Also, big run from run for cover. The second half was much better than the first half, but it's going to be Lozado. It's well, the biggest, second biggest outsider in the race who wins the third. Number one, Lozado is a surprise for quite a few of us here. Billy Dater is uh, the winning conditioner. Well into Mr. Marais. Uh, this one bred by Lado Project and written to today by Diego Degavea. Diego